From dust you came, to dust you shall return. From dust you came, to dust you shall return. You are what God made you to be, created in Christ Jesus for good works, chosen as holy and beloved, free to serve your neighbor. God bless you, that you may be a blessing in the name of the holy and life-giving Trinity. Amen. From dust you came, to dust you shall return. You are what God made you to be, created in Christ Jesus for good works, chosen as holy and beloved, free to serve your neighbor. God bless you in that, that you may be a blessing. In the name of the holy and life-giving Trinity, amen. From dust you came, to dust you shall return. You are what God made you to be, created in Christ Jesus for good works, chosen as holy and beloved, free to serve your neighbor. God bless you, that you may be a blessing in the name of the holy and life-giving Trinity. Amen. The imposition of ashes looks different this year. Of course, on video, the uh, imposition of ashes is impossible. We had the drive-through ash imposition service today, and a lot of you participated in that. It was nice to see you and nice to begin this journey of Lent in that way. If you were not able to be there, that's okay. I completely understand. At this point of our Ash Wednesday video service, though, I just invite you to take a moment to take your own finger and trace the sign of the cross on your forehead. For this moment, remember your mortality. Remember the precious and precarious gift of this life. And remember that sign of the cross with which you were marked in your own baptism, a sign of life and promise and hope. And as those two symbols come together, Remember that you're immortal. Remember that God is with us. And in that sign of the cross, remember that life is God's final word for us. Amen.